Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Tanya Ghosh and you're watching Trending Bread. So this video is going to be about you and me. If you don't know me, I am a creator and I create videos around fashion, travel, beauty, fitness, makeup and basically it is all about lifestyle. So if you are interested in any of these genres, please do not forget to subscribe and also hit the bell icon so that whenever I upload a new video, you get notified about it. A few days ago, I have posted this story on my Instagram. Tell me your assumptions questions about me and I will answer them on my YouTube video and I was so glad to see the overwhelming response from you guys the best part was there was no negative comments and I was so happy about my virtual family so without any delay let's get started with the video and it's gonna be fun immediate next story I have also mentioned that if you want I will take few of your names as well just let me know so there was only one person who wanted me to take his name I will gradually take the name as uh, we move on with the video so the first question was Bakka 90 scared question mark and uh, are you married question mark so yes I am 90s kid and I am 1995 born to be exact and the answer to this question are you married no I am not married yet the next assumption is you are always happy so this is purely a myth that's just an assumption people assume that I'm always happy I am not always happy but yes I try to be happy I feel happy but the truth is that I also cry a lot which I of course don't show to you guys which I don't record and put up on my stories and videos okay there's one more question which says how do you deal with inner grown hairs please suggest me so yes the best way to deal with inner grown hair is uh, shaving I feel personally but obviously uh, it can be different for everybody else you can go for shaving uh, waxing or laser treatment waxing can create a lot of pain laser can be really costly and shaving is cheap and without pain moving on to the next question uh, best self-care tips you can give me I think the best self-care is doing meditation uh, meditation has a lot of power which you can feel once you start doing meditation gradually the next question we will move on to uh, what weather do you like more I think I love all the weathers uh, whether it is sunny cloudy windy rainy I love it all trust me there is a different feeling in different weathers so I enjoy it all moving on to the next assumption <laughs> this is the funniest assumption I have come across till now uh, you are a rich kid no I'm not a rich kid only because I do blogging and I travel a lot I am a youtuber that doesn't mean I am born rich I am from a normal average middle class family my uh, mom is a government teacher government school teacher and my dad is homeopathy doctor so yes like most of you I belong to a middle class family the next question uh, the next assumption you are soft and calm but have you ever hated anyone so badly and have grudge on that person um, I think hate is a very uh, strong word and I haven't hated anyone but of course I had my personal issues with a lot of people I had my own fights with a lot of people so yes I had my fights and I had my personal issues but I haven't hated anyone till now and I don't think I'm gonna hate anyone because it's a very strong word to use and I feel the more you hate someone uh, it creates a negative feeling inside your mind and body and it also shows on your face and your expressions so I don't think I'm gonna ever hate someone like that do you have any regrets that you never shared truly I know you have a beautiful heart um, I have shared uh, my sorrows with my closed ones I never keep it inside my heart because I cannot uh, even if I feel bad I cry it out and uh, I take it out from my heart and mind I just cannot keep it inside it just makes me feel sad and I go all depressed so if I feel bad I share it with my closed ones and I just get over it 
and so many regular questions uh, that I've already answered on my stories and I don't think you will be interested to watch it here who is your favorite actor and all that I don't have any favorite actor seriously everybody is equally good so yes I don't have any favorite actor uh, yes what do you like doing the most over weekends this is a very thoughtful question mm, uh, sometimes I love to go for playing badminton or swimming I love spending uh, my weekend with my loved ones or my friends uh, partying <laughs> house partying or maybe playing some games drinking um yeah that's it nothing special i don't like going uh, to clubs and all over weekends so yeah i try to be at home and uh, spend time with my loved ones which is your favorite netflix series trust me i don't watch too much of tv or any uh, series or anything i do not play uh, laptop or PC games. I don't know. I don't just I just don't like it Okay, uh, the next question is who is your favorite board game? I think the question was what is your favorite board game? So I'll answer this my favorite board game uh, is has to be Ludo I think yes Ludo then again the regular questions favorite movie where do you usually hang out when i'm at andaman my usual hangout spot is carbon scope if you ever visit to andaman and nicobar islands you should definitely visit this uh, carbon scope beach it is in the city tour uh, i think it should be enlisted in your uh, city tours but yes uh, that is my regular hangout spot when I'm in Andaman and Nicobar Islands. Otherwise, when I'm in Bangalore, um, my house is my usual hangout spot. So yes, moving on to the next assumption. Oh, I keep coming back to your page, lovely feed. Then why don't you just follow me? Why do you have to keep coming back to my page? <laughs> okay, uh, beautiful posts. Thank you, thank you. Great profile, thank you. Uh, what is your favorite thing to do every day? Uh, so my favorite thing to do every day is I think creating videos for you all. Very recently I have started creating videos regularly. Uh, you are the cutest I have ever met. Your works are amazing. You are such a beautiful soul. Thank you so much Sanjana Di. I know you haven't asked me to take your name but seriously you are a... Uh, one of my very closest friend from college so thank you so much she has also written you not only work for your good but also for others and a great and cheerful person you lit up the mood thank you again so few people have also texted me uh, let me just search and take it out okay so this person has personally texted me and said me take my name also adoring your beautiful smile always want to see you motive of starting with uh, insta every morning just to see your pretty smile thank you so much rahul it is such a sweet message and his question is how do you get so much positive energy every day waking up so early and working out i am planning to do uh, so from last few months but uh, do not feel like waking up so basically whenever i come home and stay with my mom and dad i get this energy to wake up early in the morning and start working out because my dad and mom wakes up early at around 5 every day and they do their exercise so seeing that i also get motivated and i wake up early gossip with them and have some morning tea and do the workout and help them out with the regular household work there's one more question by the same person asking what is your height and weight i haven't checked my weight since the lockdown so before lockdown i checked my weight was uh, 61 kgs and my uh, height is 5.4 inch full name of this person is rahul gupta all your products especially makeup are being sponsored this is a wrong assumption most of the makeup products have been gifted by my sister to me and few of them i bought myself and yes and that 10 percent of makeup products have been sent to me so not all the products are uh, sponsored the next assumption about me is i am punjabi 
uh, no, I am Bengali. I am not Punjabi. Few people in the past have also told me that I look like Malayali girl. But no, neither I am Malayali nor I am Punjabi. I am pure a bong material. I am Bengali. The next assumption about me is that I am a very good dancer. That is a very false assumption. I used to practice Bharatnatyam uh, in my primary grades. But uh, since I started my higher education and my college and everything, I stopped uh, practicing Bharatnatyam so I have forgot almost everything except Tathai uh, Thaya and uh, all those uh, few mudras I remember but uh, except that I have totally forgot all the steps and dance and everything but yeah like everybody else I can do the Bollywood dancing you have full-on photo shoots all the time no dude, I don't always do photo shoots. So I divide my schedule for uh, editing, shooting and uh, videography and everything uh, for a week and I follow that. So uh, I do photo shoots like uh, for two days in a week maybe continuously or if I am tired. I try to separate and keep gap for at least one or two days in between those uh, shooting days and I go out and I dedicate full one day to shoot outside if you're thinking that it's just fun go pose and shoot it's not like that it is uh, about uh, matching your dress and shoes and makeup and your hair and finding that correct spot uh, it is very tiring if you want I can create a video regarding my shoot days how do I do and uh, how it goes after this COVID-19 crisis gets over, I will make sure I make one video on this. So yes, I think I have answered most of the questions and I have cleared most of the assumptions, wrong assumptions about me. And uh, that is all about this video. I hope you enjoyed this. And if you want me to do similar kind or more, then let me know in the comment section below or just text me in any of my social media links and I will try to do one more video of similar kind. But till then, if you like this video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. And I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye. Take care.